is September 20th. My bad, my bad. The game is out. Episode 2 is out. Let's play it. Let's see who is framing me and Falcone at the same time. Is it gonna be... Is it gonna be... The Penguin? Don't know. Oh, did I play this? I played this with keyboard last time, right? Okay. We will be doing the keyboard again. <clears throat> Episodes. What are these extras? Oh, okay. Codex. So that's like the Book of Fables. Videos. What? No, I don't want to watch this. I just want to play the game. Start episode two. Children of Arkham. An old friend becomes a new adversary. As Bruce learns more about the Wayne family legacy. And Batman escalates the fight against crime and corruption throughout Gotham. It's got to be the Penguin. Right? Let's see. Revolution is knocking on Gotham's door. When this whole thing starts, make sure you're on the right side. Mr. Wayne, thank you for opening your house to us. Together, we Car will change Gotham. Let's put a dent in crime. Dent, Gotham's next mayor, and eager to know you. Vicky Vale. Ooh, he's putting the moves Not on Vicky Vale. And reporter for the Gotham Gazette. Carmine Falcone? Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Like, how does Harvey Your not know that he's shocked? You mean shake. people know that they're organized crime? I didn't know that. Don't you know not to corner a wild animal? It's dangerous. Bye, Bat. <laughs> this is Selena. She knows I'm the bat. I'd have to count the pieces. Falcone's calling card. Or somebody made it the look like Falcone. Where are they? Swear to me. You and played in, couldn't you? It's. The Waynes. <laughs> it's so funny that he's like, I know uh, who's behind this frame Waynes. up of me. It's Bruce uh, Wayne. <laughs> Damn, I didn't notice Alfred was in the picture before. And Alfred, Alfred told me that my parents didn't want to associate with people like Carmine Falcone. And then there's a picture of them. He's right there in the room. It's like when Obi-Wan Kenobi lied to me about who my father was. He said my father was dead and it used to be Darth Vader. It, it really turned out to be Darth Vader. Alfred's lying to me. Wayne Memorial Auditorium. Mayoral debates. As long as nobody gets pneumonia, we're going to hold those debates. Mayor Hill might get... Pneumonia. You don't have to do this. Only you now, Master Bruce. Crime Alley. I didn't know he had a plaque in Crime Alley. There it says. It's Crime Alley. Never knew he put a plaque there. I wonder if that's canon. I thought I might find you here. In the loving memory of upsetting for both of us. My parents. But you should see this. There's graffiti everywhere. <laughs> I know you come here for solitude, Bruce. More allegations about his ties to the underworld. This isn't going away. It's all so public and messy. People are throwing stones at my family, Alfred. I need to understand why. It's my family, too. Don't forget that. 
I've been dreading this day for nearly two decades. I, I hoped it would never come. I Forget the papers. I want to hear it from Thanks for you. the follow, Mini Pekka. The truth is, they were billionaires, Bruce. You can't amass that kind of wealth without making certain moral compromises. It's just not possible. That kind of money taints you. My money is never corrupted. It's like Donald I'm Trump proud of inviting you. the Clintons to his but wedding. You're hardly the norm. Hill greased the wheels of politics. Falcone was the muscle. Thomas legitimized the whole enterprise with his name. Your father, Hamilton Hill and Falcone, they were partners. Nothing happened in Gotham without them knowing. You knew all that, and you never let on. You're behaving like I was part of the conspiracy. I want you to know I had my suitcases ready. I couldn't stand to be around your father anymore. But then they were killed. And you <laughs> were all alone. And I just couldn't walk out the door. Everything I did, everything I've ever done, was out of love for you. I hope you can forgive me. How could I hold this against you? You're all I've got, Alfred. Thank you. I won't let you down again. <laughs> Alfred's letting me know he thought my father was a right prick and he was ready to This is the first leave. time I've been back here since that night. When the police called me to collect you, I thought they'd finally arrested your father. I couldn't believe a low-life thug like Joe Chill would have the audacity to rob and kill Thomas Wayne. He was simply too well known. Too... too big. Joe Chill had no chill. Yet, there it was. Yeah, I don't think he knew who it was. Wouldn't Chill just run when he recognized him? Well, it's a fair assumption. But he didn't. You always said it was a simple mugging. In 20 years, you've never wavered from that story. Oh, okay. I can recall every moment of that night. So are they going to say that it was a hit on the Waynes now? Wrong. Sometimes we block out things we don't want to face. Maybe there was some detail I overlooked. Let's look for clues now, 20 years later. Seriously? I'm supposed to look for clues. Search the alley to remember the past. Come on. It's 20 years. Alright. They're gonna try and rewrite history here. I don't know if I'm digging this. I want him standing here. Right now. And what would the Batman do with his own parents' killer? The possibilities are frightening. Take him to jail, just like any other criminal. Batman but doesn't he's kill. Not just any criminal, is he? He was stabbed to death in prison. No one mourns for Joe Chill. So they're Earth. saying it was hit, and then they took out Joe Chill, so he wouldn't be able to talk. That he was put up to it. I don't like that idea. If that's what they're doing. Like, the Waynes should be above reproach, in my opinion. He no. just wanted to protect us. He thought he was invincible. Sadly, he was mistaken. I always wanted to be brave. Just like him. And you are. He would be so proud to see that you took a different path. We went to see Zorro at the movies, and we decided to take a shortcut through the graffiti alley. I love that movie. Saw it countless times at that theater. How long did it play there? Only when you wanted to see it, Bruce. Your 
mother arranged the special screenings personally. I never knew that. What? She was always so good to me. We're like Justin Bieber ran out the whole theater? I thought it was weird we were the only ones in the movies. Where exactly does the memory end? With my father pleading, you don't have to do this. And the gun fires. And after that? Uh, there are considerable gaps in that recollection. Maybe. Do I really want to know? I need you. Hey, Angel. Is he going to take the pearls? There's the pearls, the iconic pearl shot. Man, you're going to rub out a little kid? Yeah, I don't Bruce, like that. Are you all right? I don't like that the rewrite wasn't this. a mug. They were assassinated, and Carmine Falcone knows why. Hmm. I'm Batman. Why didn't you go to school today, Ninja? Somebody's getting in you hurry. in to see Falcone like this. I don't have to tell you how many rules we're breaking. Hey, it's the Mohawk guy. Don't get me wrong. I'm always here for you. But this could land us both in hot water. I pulled all the strings about I that, Mike. The this better not come back to bite us. Look, I get that hard, okay? And it means a lot to me. I know it does, Bruce. It doesn't make it any easier. The last time you disappeared behind closed doors with Falcone, the press made us pay. At least tell me what this is about. Look, I'm all for blind support, but I should at least know what I'm getting myself into. This is a personal matter, Harvey. <laughs> I can't believe people Fine, are pulling the alarm at four me, in the morning. But I hope none of this comes back to bite us. I don't want headlines taking away from my debate with Hill. Dent? Mr. Wayne, welcome to the GCPD. Thank you, Lieutenant. Now, ordinarily, we'd never let you in to see Falcone, but it uh, must be nice to have a DA in your pocket, Mr. Wayne. Yeah, you should Better get one. Rules you should try. You need it. I realize this is irregular, Lieutenant. I wouldn't ask if there was another way. I'm vouching for him, Gordon. Trust me, he's one of the good guys. A good guy who always gets what they want. <laughs> now, in my book, there's no such thing. Oh, the humidity nice made job the alarm go off? Balcone. Yeah, that son of a bitch better not get off again. He's Montoya. not getting off the hook, Rene. Rene Montoya! Wayne, Sergeant Rene Montoya. I just wanted to say, you know, some of us police support you, despite what the media is saying. 
Thanks, Sergeant. We're keeping Falcone in the infirmary. He's lucky he didn't get roughed up more. I could tell Batman wanted to kill him, but he held back. He cares about doing the right thing. I know he does a lot for the department, but <laughs> honestly, Batman freaks me out. Oh, he's definitely freaky. But I'm glad he's out there watching over the city. Oh my god, the alarm went off for two hours. All right, Falcone's inside. You say what you gotta say. We'll be out here. All right. Episode two. I could tell Batman wanted to kill Falcone. Seriously? I hurt this guy this bad? Children of Arkham. The hell? Bruce Wayne? You must have some clout. My own wife can't get in to see me. <laughs> Good thing I'll be out of here in a week. <laughs> Just like every other time they tried to put me away. We need to talk, Falcone. You weren't so eager the last time we met. But then, I knew you'd come around. Especially after the press got their teeth in you. <laughs> You're your father's son. Yeah, that's right. Tommy and I were close. More than friends. More like cousins. Going back decades. Until you sent Joe Chill to kill him. Ah, so that's what this is really about, eh? The pup digging up a 20-year-old killer. <laughs> Two kind killers. of important. And they were never forgotten. Just supposed to get you over me, my parents getting rubbed out. Practically family. I thought you'd have figured that out by now. Hey, I tried to get through to your dense party. Maybe I should have spelled it out. Got a whole closet full of birthday presents I was never able to give you. It's a damn shame you asked me. Convince me then. Tell me a story about our big, happy family. <laughs> there it is. Now I got you hooked. Your father, Hill, and me. We ran this city. Still do. <clears throat> God damn this uh -oh. pain. Is he gonna die? Can't think through it. Morphine's on the side there. Be a good boy and help Uncle Carmine out, huh? Uh... <sighs> Hurt him? I keep my veins clean of any of that gunk. But you never forget the tender kiss. It'd be so easy to give me the whole vial, wouldn't it? Enough there to put an old dog down forever. Of course, you'd never know the whole story. How much of your parents do you have in you? What kind of son did Thomas Wayne make? I'm not a murderer. No, you're not. That's why you were kept in the dark. Much better, kid. Thank you. <laughs> Just you like that reminds me of your mother. Don't you talk about my mother. Your father may have been the doctor, but Martha... She had the human touch. Think you got more of her in you, tell the truth. Yeah. There's a kindness in you. You care about people. <laughs> Even mean old bastards like me. <laughs> well, I wouldn't know. You took her from me when I was nine years old. What, you really think I hired Chill? Sure. I worked with Joe Chill from time to time. Put a button on someone, he'd take him out. But I never ordered that hit on your parents. So who did? So who did? Oh, Jinx. You owe me milkshake, Bruce you Wayne. You can't trust anyone in Gotham. Least of all those you call friend. 
Your parents learned that. The what the fuck? What the fuck? They're waiting for you in hell. What the fuck? The What's going down. on with Montoya? To die. She looks like she's a oh. Down. Get a doctor. Is she affected Secure by the chemicals? No one out. Go. Go. The psychotic chemicals. So what was he gonna say? Cobble pots? It's kind of a regular that I'm in here with this situation too, isn't it, Mary, Lieutenant Gordon? Deep shit. Oh, I bought us some time, but not much. Or it's gonna get out, sooner or later. Why would she do something like this? We had Gotham's biggest crime lord in our grasp. This close, we were this close! Yeah, something was wrong with her. Know. She had like all... I hardly recognized her when she burst in. Blue she around her face so and different stuff. from the woman we met in the hall. <sighs> it's a disgrace. Another officer gone rogue. It just doesn't make any sense. She'd never do anything in <coughs> the department. Oh, Falcone's case meant justice for a thousand unnamed victims. And now it is a PR disaster. How can I run against corruption when our own cops are redecorating <laughs> the precinct with their prisoners' brains? <laughs> Listen, we gotta get out in front Mafia of this. Mafia lives matter. Spin it as best we can. Issue a statement saying that we have the shooter in custody. Uh, details are still coming in and that we're investigating. The, the usual. Slow down, Harvey. We need the facts first. The simple fact is she walked in and shot him. Then we need the complex facts, like how and why. Gosh, uh, you don't think Harvey did it. Attorney? Could Harvey have worse. done it? Oh, Christ. I can delay them for a little while, but we still need answers. But what, what sense does it make for Harvey to do it? Tell me if she says anything. I have to know why she did this. Uh. Alfred, Falcone's been murdered. Good God. I'm looking into it, but I'll need access to the back computer for anything I find. <laughs> I'm talking Gosh, about the God. back computer in front of a like Alfred, semi conscious I'm gonna try and confirm police some officer. Suspicions of mine. Yeah, see this around her, her mouth. It looks her veins. Yeah, still visible beneath her skin. And is there a injection mark here? A fresh injection site. Mm, that doesn't look like blood. Well, who could, who else could have injected her here? In Alfred, the I think I found the substance. Harvey, Analyze and forward me the result. I'll be in touch as soon as I have the results. Where am I? Mr. Wayne? My name is Rene Montoya, and I have killed the father oh, of the Mafia. Oh, but I got this awful feeling something terrible happened. Oh, everything is such a blur. Sergeant, you have to think. What do you remember? Oh, God. Falcone. I was hoping it wasn't real. I believe you were drugged, Sergeant. I... It would explain a lot. Listen, you have to believe me. I talk big about hurting thugs like Falcone. <laughs> My name is Remine Montoya. Prepare to die. Betray the lieutenant. <laughs> Everything is so foggy. <laughs> I remember. You saw where I was going pain. with that, Mike. There's an injection site on your neck. Then I just felt light. Like I could do whatever I wanted. No guilt. No consequence. There was a voice in my ear insisting Falcone was going to get off. And all I knew was that I had to stop that. I had to. No matter what. 
The reasons why I shouldn't. They were a million miles away. D did you see a face? Could you ID a suspect? I... I don't think so. You must remember some detail. Try. I remember a hand on my arm. Guiding me. Like a parent with a child. We the did voice, see the pink mohawk guy there. Revolution? Revolution. Revolution. Cobblepot said something similar. You say you want I'm a so revolution. I'm oh. I'm you down. We stalled Falcone's lawyers for now, but they'll be back. So how is she? Did she tell you anything? Yeah, hey, 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 don't worry about that now. I found evidence that she was drugged. A fresh injection site on her neck. I was out of my mind, Lieutenant. Please believe me. Hey, I do. Of course I do. Hey, get forensics in here. Now! She remembers a voice saying something about revolution. That's not much to go on. Now, if you're bringing forensics in, let's get Bruce out. Alfred, I gotta get back to the manor. I've got a lead on whoever's behind this. Bruce! <laughs> what are you doing here? My friends in the, in the GCPD have been Can't telling stories. Can't you leave me alone? Some kind of lockdown? I, I'm, I'm sorry, Vicky. I, I don't have time. Don't brush me off. <laughs> Word is there were shots fired near where Falcone was being held. Know anything about that? I mean, you must have been back there when it happened. Where did you get that? So it's true? <laughs> no, I didn't say that. Listen, I owe you for those files on Falcone. I got a lot of credit at the Gazette for that story. Whatever's going on here, you can't afford to be associated with it. So let me get the hell out of here then and stop asking me questions about it. Let me help you. I can keep your name out of whatever we print, but you need to give me something I can use. Who fired the shots? A, a cop? I can tell by the way you're brushing me off that something happened. Just give me something to run with. Please, get out of my way, Vicky. I'm in a hurry. Sorry, Vicky. Huh. I don't want to throw Renee funny. under the bus. Maybe you have more to do with this than I thought. I don't want to throw Montoya under the bus. It's not my it's not my job to do Vicky's job for her. I can Either use her when it drug suits Montoya me, himself or someone else is using his revolutionary rhetoric. Either way, I need to find him. Let's put our drones in the air and start a search. I'll run a trace on his cell. In the meantime, we have to find out what we can do about this drug. The computer's been analyzing the chemicals from Montoya's bloodstream. Throw that up on the monitor. The residue I scan on Montoya is similar to the nerve agent I found for Docs. Let's see what we got. It's ironic that Falcone died at the hands of someone drugged with his chemicals. Who'd have guessed that's how he'd meet his maker? Who would like a joke like Alone that? In his sick bed. Surrounded by police who were ordered to protect him. Murder at the hands of Montoya. That's not justice. Whoever did this was judge, jury, and executioner. No one should act as all three. I hope he told you something before he was killed. What did you learn from him? Practically family, he said. Family? Funny, I don't recall any Sunday dinners with the mob. <laughs> it wasn't Falcone who called the hit. Yeah, well, I suppose that makes sense. Your father, Hill, and Falcone would have balanced each other out. Computers pinpointed reference points on the two compounds. The men at the docks were doused with the base chemicals. The reaction was... Messy. They were out of control. This refined drug is like a weapon. It only took a small injection to strip Montoya of her moral filters. And make her act on her base impulses. 
Both compounds seem stable, but they're quick to fall apart. Whoever processed it knew what they were doing. What could the creators of such a drug possibly have in mind? Fighting your wars is one thing, but drugging others to fight them for you... Oh. With this drug, they can exploit anyone's baser impulses, the things they would otherwise control. Your drones are in position to triangulate Cobblepot's location. Select a drone to search for Oswald's cell phone signal. Alright, let's try this one. Press when you find a portion of the signal. search This one. Falcone's body to get cold, did you, Oz? Going to speak with him, Bruce? Bruce Wayne already tried talking with Cobblepot. It's time he met the Batman. Dun, dun, dun. All right, Penguin, let's get it on. Wah, 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 wah. Not exactly Burgess Meredith's version of the Penguin, are you? It's more like the Gotham version of the Penguin. Is that guy on the drugs? That huge guy that's blue and everything? He looks kind of weird. Where is it? I don't know! Please! No names! I... You can help me. Or... <laughs> Let him go. Batman! It's even... about time! Did... Let you him kill a crime speech. boss, you'd expect a word of thanks from Gotham's number one vigilante. Oh, don't worry, I'll pass your gratitude on to those who made it happen. They'll be pleased to know you think so highly of their work. I said let him go. You hear that, Roland? That sounded like an order. I'll crush him. Now, now, hey, Roland. have a little respect for the bat. Think he underestimates you. Is this about Falcone? We all saw how you felt about Falcone. Pounded him into a pump on live TV. If you were truly the defender of this city, you'd have finished the job yourself! Admit it, Falcone deserved to die. Vermin like Falcone 
They deserve to be stomped out. Believe me, I know from personal experience. You don't decide who lives and who dies. That's not justice. But it's bloody well satisfying, isn't it? As a show of good faith, I'm gonna let this one go. How's about we talk this through? We helped you with Falcone. Now, if we could just cut out the rest of the rot, like Wayne and Hill, ordinary folks might be able to breathe. Oswald Cobblepot. What is it about this place that attracts criminal scum like you? Gotta admit, you've got flair. Here's the thing. I actually It reminds me that. of uh We Georgie. both want the same kinds of things. From the Wolf Among Me us. and my people, we've got big plans for Gotham. They found Catwoman. What do you want with her? We had a deal. She didn't make good on it. So sorry this didn't work out, mate. I'd stay to watch. I would, but I still got a cat uh -oh. woman to deal with. Oh, what's her name again? Selena. Yes! Oh, beautiful name. <laughs> <laughs> well then. The end. <laughs> Roland might have to go flying out this window here. He's gonna have to like try that. harder than this. Oh shit! Surprise! I'm back! Is he gone? Damn, Roland, you're fast. Where did you go? Alfred, track down Selena Kyle. I'll find her right away. Gotta play some pool. The stacked deck. I feel a barroom brawl coming on. Okay, let's go. A new twist in the race for the mayor's office as Harvey Dent backer Bruce Wayne comes under fire for alleged corruption. Joining me live is Mayor Hamilton Hill. Mr. Mayor, you said earlier today that in light of the allegations against him, Bruce Wayne should distance himself from Dent, but that was unlikely to happen. Why? He strikes me as well, the jealous sort, very possessive of his toys. Better keep a low profile. Put my hoodie up. Cops raided his house. <laughs> Sorry, his manor. Oh shit. Didn't you see the game here, asshole? Sorry, Goldberg. Are you blind or something? My bad. I'm not looking for trouble. It looks like he found you. Wait a minute, I know you. You're that rich dude. You're that guy on the news. Yeah, I get that all the time. It's something about the chin. <laughs> you think I'm dumb? Bruce, 
Stop stirring up the natives and buy me a drink. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> this guy's with you? Face it, Frank, you suck at pool. Why are you starting trouble over it? <sighs> nice one, Bruce. Way to keep a low profile. Selena, I need to tell you something important. Better be an apology. You were supposed to take care of our mutual problem. Instead, you just pissed him off. I'm sorry things went down the way they did, but I have information. The man who hired you, his name is Oswald Cobblepot. Never heard of him. He goes by Penguin. Penguin? Shit. Ugh, you've got to be kidding me. You should have just killed me on that rooftop. <laughs> I'm dead anyway. When you screw someone over, you How's really Penguin got a big name all of a sudden? The Penguin. <laughs> penguin can't take on both of us, and I'm not going anywhere. Clearly you know something about him. I only know him by reputation. I'm surprised you never heard of him. He's a big deal across the pond. I thought he's, he's more broke. dangerous than you think. I've seen his rap sheet. Just a string of petty crimes, nothing major. So he's good at covering his tracks. No one gets to his level without knowing how to keep a low profile. Besides, you really think there's another guy going by Penguin? The question is, why Gotham? Why now? It's not like he's hurting for crime syndicates abroad. Why leave that? He thinks he's changing the world for the better, no matter the cost. Well, he's no Joan of Arc, that's for sure. Well, I'm not sticking around here to find out. Oswald, Penguin is about to unleash God knows what on the city. You can't just leave. A good reason not to be here when he does. You want to stay? That's your choice. If Penguin is everything you say, there's no tree high enough for you to climb. He will find you. So what are you suggesting? The bat helps the cat? And the cat helps the bat. Bruce, sweetie. The gallant knight thing, it really is adorable. But what would Harvey think? The two of us, working together? After all, I'm not really an all work and no play kind of girl. Harvey knows that. I'm sorry, why are, why are we talking about Harvey? <laughs> He's your friend, isn't he? Just seeing how much of a conscience you really have. You and I... <laughs> Hipsters! Hipsters with pipes! Well, Bruce, you were right. Selena Kyle, Penguin says hello. Aww. Beat it. I was Where hoping they're gonna put on Steeler's Wheel, to be honest. If you care about your own skin, you'll get the hell out. Hey, hipster with a knife! Hey, 
Take that, hipster. See, Selena, we make a good team getting back. More. Then let's give it to him. Good for such a pretty boy. Uh oh, somebody called the cops. Time to go. Quick, get some evidence. Come on, this way. We got his iPhone. We can listen to all his songs on iTunes. These cops, they're on top of it. Can you see anything? They know what they're doing. Negative. Let's check the other side. Are we alone? I think we're alone now. There doesn't seem to be any cops around. We should go. I'll take the rooftops. You take the alley. Wait. When will I see you again? <sighs> when you least expect it. All right. Sounds good. You shouldn't trust me, you know. That's why I didn't kiss you, because I can't trust you. Can't trust a woman. Alfred, I'm uploading the contents of a smartphone to the back computer. Check to see if there's anything on the phone we can use. Uh, processing it now. Is everything all right? There are quite a few police cars convening on your location. <laughs> it's fine. Is the back computer found I'm just stand right here and do it. There are a number of messages here. Mayor Hill? Mayor Hill's the last involved. Mail is his. Listen to this. I gave you everything I have on Wayne. I've held up my end of the bargain, and I expect you to do the same. This is very shady indeed. Whatever they're talking about, it doesn't sound good. I should have guessed. Hill's working with Penguin. If Hill's talking to Penguin, he must know something. It's time I paid him a visit. I agree. The mayor must have answers, but if I may offer a word of advice. People look up to Batman after how you handle Falcone. Terrorizing the mayor could damage that goodwill. Hmm. Then again, Batman's methods would certainly get him talking immediately. Bruce would have to depend on his guile to loosen Hill's lips. Hmm. I think it would be more fun to go as Batman, but it's probably more prudent to go as Bruce. Uh, nah, screw it. Do I care about my reputation with the press? Yeah, I'm going as Batman. Just gonna be more interesting that way. Going as Batman is the sure bet. Ow. Blood test today. 
sticky bandages. All right, here we go. Batman has the public trust after taking down Falcone. Yeah. Try not to throw it away by going overboard on Hill. Battering the mayor is not a good option, despite his more than checkered reputation. Don't worry, Alfred. I'm a light touch when I need to be. The city will thank me later if Hill tells me Penguin's plans. Deborah, you incompetent! Dents up in the polls. I need to crucify him in the debate or we can kiss re-election and your job goodbye. You'd better be back here in the next 15 minutes or I'm cutting your pay. Who's there? Deborah. Deborah. EMP knocked it out. Was that you? Expecting someone. Maybe the penguin. Oh. Batman? What are you doing here? You know who Penguin is. So I've heard of him. So what? I've got nothing to do with that lowlife. Do you hear me? You're leaving out a few details. <gasps> I gave you everything I have on Wayne. I've held up my end of the bargain, and I expect you to do the same. Wayne! There's the real problem. He's the one you should be after. Every fiber of his being built on lies. His status, his fortune. He should be held accountable. What does Penguin want with Bruce Wayne? The atrocities that occurred at the hands of his father. He only wants to expose the Waynes for the criminals that they are. <gasps> Security! Pick up, goddammit! Security! I think, I think your phone's not working there, Mayor Hill. Don't kill me! I've done nothing wrong! I want the truth. And I'll break every bone in your body to get it. You're insane. Just like they say. A madman in a mask. Penguin wants revenge for what happened to his mother. Thomas Wayne sent her to Arkham, along with who knows how many other innocents. Nothing was wrong with any of them until Thomas locked them up. Really? Something this big couldn't have been hidden. There'd be records. <sighs> with enough money, you can make anything or anyone disappear. <gasps> I didn't dare speak up. Whatever happened in the past, it's nothing compared to what's happening now. Penguin isn't the only child of Arkham. There are others whose families were destroyed by Wayne. They'll make Gotham pay for his sins. <gasps> No, please, don't. Oh, no. You deserve whatever's coming for you. If I had given Penguin what he wanted, he would have struck at the debate tonight. I didn't just do this for myself. I'm trying to protect Gotham. Uh -oh. Finally, about damn time. It's Batman, shoot him! Come on, get the mayor out of here. My magical dodecahedron. What he said about your father, it must be difficult to process. I need to know what went on at Arkham Asylum. Indeed, I'm just as frustrated as you are. Hill seems to think he's safe, but Penguin's still out there. The incumbent. Is on here. As per your request, Lieutenant Gordon has tripled security at the debate. Thanks, Alfred. But 
Gordon heard about Batman's surprise visit to the mayor. He was far from happy. Get Thanks for it. the heads up. It's a plan of the old Monarch Theater. The auditorium where the debate's being held. Hmm. I hacked into the image feeds from the security cameras at the auditorium. Just to be safe. Just to be safe. Hills, details about your father. They must have been quite upsetting. I can't imagine how you must feel. To learn so much in so little time. To hear their crimes detailed. First by a Falcone, then by a snake like Hill. It makes me question myself. You shouldn't, Bruce. You are your own man. And the city needs you. Now more than ever. I'll, uh, leave you to it then. Gotham District Attorney Harvey Dent appears to be hitting some potholes on his path to the mayor's office. Despite the backing of billionaire Bruce Wayne, rumors persist that the candidate is having trouble paying his campaign staff and making ad buys. A Dent spokesperson said these rumors are nothing more than a smear tactic perpetuated by the incumbent Mayor Hill's campaign. In other news, nobody goes to Gotham's dive bars expecting a quiet night out, but police say a brawl tonight at the Stack Deck Bar in Otisburg was the rowdiest one in recent memory. Reports say multiple arrests were made, with all the suspects taken into custody while unconscious. Whoops. Police are seeking an unidentified man and woman who were seen in conversation with the assailants shortly before the fight. Gotham District Attorney Harvey Dent appears to be hitting some potholes on his path to the mayor's office. Despite the backing of billionaire Bruce Wayne, rumors persist that the candidate is having trouble paying his campaign staff. Wait a minute. The images on these cameras haven't changed. Uh -oh. Something's wrong. Uh-oh. Penguin's they... men may have commandeered the cameras on there. Got them on a loop. We could just be looking at... What they want us to see. Warn Gordon that he may have visitors. I have to get down there. Now. How exactly does Alfred warn Commissioner Gordon? Batman says, don't mind my English accent. Harvey needs to get out of there. Hey, Bruce. Man, I'm glad you called. I needed to talk to you, actually. Something's come up. Something that's, well, it's not exactly pleasant. Why, why what happened? Are you all right? Me? Oh, Maybe yeah, he has a voice fine. modulator too, no, yeah. I mean because of this penguin threat. I suppose. They have me in some back room until the debate begins. For my own protection, they said. A little bit of overkill, he tweets me. at Lieutenant uh, Gordon. Look, Bruce, I didn't want to do this over the phone, but... My advisors are telling me that I need to... <clears throat> that I need to distance myself from you. Until all this mess with your family blows over. I don't care. They're afraid it's not a very... I, I get it. It's the smart move. But let's talk about that later. I'm glad you see it that way. What with the allegations in the press, and now this mess with Falcone, you're a liability. But here's the thing, Bruce. Without your money, I am dead <laughs> in the water. I, I, I need your money. Out, but I need but... you to keep me. Float. I don't want I you to do it publicly. Public, but you and me, we all know the truth about our friendship. No matter what, we need a new page, hey, man. Hill needs to be removed. I, I knew you'd see it that way. Listen, I hate to push you, but I, I need to know. Can I count on your money, Bruce? Whatever it takes to save Gotham, that's what we wanted. I'll always support you, Harvey. Oh, thank you, Bruce. Thank you. 
You don't know how much this means to me. To Gotham. I'm sorry, Bruce. Wouldn't the makeup there be like here. rules where you have to have transparency <laughs> and the donations? Put on my face. I hope you can still watch the debate somewhere. Uh, no matter what I have to say tonight, remember, you are always my friend. Thanks, Harvey. Maybe you could make me Secretary of State when you become President, Hillary. I mean, um, Harvey. Yeah, all quiet so far. I've got a feeling that's about to change. Just so we're clear, you and me, we're on shaky ground. Jim I don't really like the fact that me. they're dirtying the uh, Batman's parents, to be honest, H-Man. I don't know. Most of the GCPD already think you're a monster. Don't prove them right. You're lucky I'm on your side. That may be you're true, lucky? But I can't that's not what I clicked. Thug. We have bigger things to worry about right now. The dialogues don't really match up with the clicks on some of these. I've got patrols on every door. You better check on them. I'd keep that holstered if I were you. What's she doing here? She was part of that robbery at the mayor's office. Really? You're gonna drag out that dead horse? I think she's mending her ways. Oh, you he's think it's right, a clever Lieutenant. idea? I don't know. I don't know. do the bad things anymore. I mean, Unless... like, they did that with... They did that with Spider-Man, right? In one of the annuals where they said, Oh, your parents were really spies for Russia. They made up a story like that. And that's why they were killed. Like, it, it's totally... I don't know. The plane accident that Peter Parker's parents died in. They rewrote it that they were spies and they had to be eliminated, so... I don't know. We'll see where it ends up. I just, I don't really like him because Batman, at his core, he's about, about bringing criminals to justice because he doesn't want anybody to be put in that position that he was put in where he's a little boy who is orphaned by a criminal and then to find out that his own parents are criminals and maybe they orphaned other people, like he's put the penguin's mother away. I don't know. He's a criminal himself. I just think it really taints him. Yeah, and then that made it into the movies with Andrew Garfield. I don't know, we'll see what happens, but I'm not a fan. Uh, to be honest, if they had done something like the Owls, the Owl Society, something new that a lot of people don't know into the story, I'd have been okay with that. I don't know. We'll see. Just to go back retroactive and like instantly Catwoman knows that Bruce Wayne is Batman. I don't know. It's on request. She met him for five minutes and she knows he's Batman, Batman already. Come back to bite me. Alpha Patrol, come in. That, um, incident in the bar. Dead is its own kind of cage. I can't stand being in it. Not that I needed your help or anything, but you Yeah, the characters back. are great. The I characters thought I could are great. Take a favor. You know, like you scratch my back, I cut some people up. Doing the right thing. Maybe there's hope for you yet. Don't read too much into it. I'm just allergic to owing you anything. None of my men on the ground are responding. Uh oh. Enough waiting. We're going in. Alpha, do you read? Now, aren't you glad I'm here? Yeah, pretty much. Let's get it on, Selena. You have a better shot than my SWAT team of getting in there quietly. I do like this costume look for Catwoman. I'm glad that they went with this look for Catwoman. You're seriously underfunded at the GCPD. Sounds like a vote for Dent, Lieutenant. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, everyone, and welcome to our live debate for the next mayor of Gotham City. This is an important debate for these two candidates, incumbent Mayor Hamilton Hill and the challenger Gotham District Attorney Harvey Dent. And it's also important for you, the citizens of Gotham, who will soon head to the polls to decide the future of your home, a 
You really like the penguin in this? I'm just curious why he even calls himself the penguin. It reminds me of the Gotham penguin, like from the TV show. It's the most similar to that. And he also reminds me of Georgie from uh, The Wolf Among Us. These cops don't look so good. Why they weren't responding. Gordon, we found one of your patrols. They've been terminated. Oh, those goddamn so sons of sorry, ladies and gents. As you might have guessed, there's been a change hey, to tonight's program. The penguin. <laughs> First order of business. <laughs> wah, wah, wah. Oh, oh, oh. That's what's gonna happen at Trump and Hillary's debate. I hate to be a doubter, Trump wants hostages. no moderator, so I don't like that's what's gonna happen. Uh, they just didn't have a head for the issues. Casualties are inevitable. It's only a question of how many. Inspiring. You really know how to pep a girl up. You'll do. Oh, it's Roland here. here. I don't Every like this Roland guy. Back there. These guys are armed to the teeth. Uh, we need a new moderator. Come on, you. You there? Yes. You. Yes. Thank it's you for Vicky. volunteering. <laughs> Please, no. Go on then, introduce the candidates. Stage fright, huh? All right, I'll get you started, but this is your show. Three hostiles, gotta take them out quietly. Roland already crushed my head once, so I gotta watch out for that guy. Oh, so what is this? I have to draw up my plan of attack here. Mm, what's this? I don't like that. I like the camera stand idea better. And this guy. It's going to be the light stand. Link. Camera stand, buddy. Light stand, here we go. Lights, camera, action! You missed your cue. Where are you going? Get away from that radio. Maybe next time. What are we right standing down. around Wait for? for line. And now, a word from our sponsor. My brothers and sisters of color. Who the hell is this? nothing to fear. We are the children of Arkham. We are here to end the masquerade. And expose the corruption that's moving your city. 
for too long. Led by your esteemed mayor, have profited from the pain of innocence. Tonight, we show you the truth. I knew this was too big for Oswald alone. Is it Harvey? Someone else is pulling the strings. Smart. Let someone else do the dirty work. Look into the hearts of these spineless creatures. Show them to me. Go on, love. You know what to do. Oh, no. <laughs> no, it's not Harvey. There's Harvey. Unless it's tape. Could be a tape. Is Harvey going to have a reaction to this now? Is this what's going to make him into Two-Face? Tell them what you really think about the city you pretend to love. Everybody in Gotham saw that moderator get shot on live TV. What's going on in there? <laughs> First off, we should incinerate the poor. Incinerate the poor. Incinerate the poor. <laughs> Harvey's gonna come off as like completely honest here. Catwoman's pretty good. Please, I'll sell you the land. Please don't do this. You had your chance. You should have made the deal we offered you. Whoa. Give her the drug. Thomas, we were, we were friends. Our best play together. You were warned, Esther. You know I Esther. what I want. Commence the procedure. Give her a dose she won't come back from. Yeah, that's too much if that's Batman's dad. Come on. They're turning her into a mannequin, don't you remember? Yeah. Batman! You certainly know how to make an entrance. Nice job, Vicky. Go. Why don't you kick the crap out of him? I don't like Roland. You got a plan for Roland? Get the drone to kill him. Hey, that was expensive. Kitty punch. I took out Thomas Wayne. That, 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 that was all him. Whoa. He didn't know when to stop. I had him killed because of it. Oh, I'm distracted now. Broke my eyepiece. So this is for her. You won't let her kill anyone else. Wait your turn, Dent. Eat this. It's a Mentos. 
You ever seen what happens when you put a Mentos inside of a Coke bottle? That's what's happening in your face. Where's your mate, Bruce Wayne? Your biggest supporter. And he didn't even turn up. Batman! The revolution's already started. It's too late to join. Your revolution is over, Penguin. On the contrary, we're just getting started. Dang, she keeps getting hit in the eye. Oh no, I gotta make a choice here. Save Harvey, save Catwoman. To be fair, Harvey, that was supposed to happen to your face. Hold your fire, damn it. Harv, you all right? Yeah, you're all right. Harvey. Where's the maniac in the mask? We need paramedics over here. Now! Y'all still gonna vote him for mayor though, right? City Hall is in chaos after Mayor Hamilton Hill was confirmed dead. While several members of the Children of Arkham have been arrested, the Penguin is still at large. That's a pretty good episode. Is that it? Oh, no. Y'all still gonna vote Harvey for mayor, right? Doesn't matter if he has half a face. He won't be the same after this. Meanwhile, the Wayne family scandal continued to escalate after the full list of Thomas Wayne's victims was released to the public. Catwoman crashing on my house. Damn, and so Two-Face was born. I wonder what would have happened if I saved Harvey. I'm really curious now. I'm going to have to YouTube that and see. Lawyers representing Bruce Wayne have no comment. What did you choose to do, Mike? You saved Harvey? Wow, that was short. Hour and 20 minutes. Okay, so you saved Harvey, so he didn't get his face burnt? What happened to Catwoman? I kind of thought that that was going to be his origin. Catwoman gets shot in the shoulder and just kind of runs off. So Harvey doesn't get his face burnt then? I kind of thought this is how Harvey was going to turn into Two-Face anyway, between the drug or something. I thought he was either going to have a bad reaction to the drug. Okay, you and 67% of the players eased Falcone's pain with morphine. You and 21% of players didn't try to kiss Selena. All the boys want to get the kisses from the girls. 78% of the boys want the kisses. Nah, he doesn't get burned. You turned him into Two-Face. I'm alright with that. He's supposed to be Two-Face. 
So this one's about 50-50. Most slightly, a slight majority visited Mayor Hill as Batman. You and 90% of players continued to fund Harvey's campaign. 9% are like, get lost. So do I still have to fund his campaign now that his face is all burnt up? Is he still running? Does he have pneumonia? Is he going to have to drop out? They just loaded him into the, the van like they bought a Persian rug like they did with Hillary. Like it was no big deal. Well, we just put him in the van. Take him away. Harvey just went to his daughter's apartment for a couple hours and then they came out. I feel fine. It's a beautiful day in Gotham. Let me kiss this little girl. But don't kiss me on this side of my face, honey. Uh... 63% of players save Catwoman over Harvey. I thought that would have been closer to 50-50. This -50. <laughs> time on Batman, oh. the Telltale series. You may have saved me, but this isn't over. You don't know these people, Bruce. Authorities are scrambling. The so-called children of Arkham have the city in a frenzy, but there's still no sign of their masked leader. With Hill and Falcone dead by their hands, the question on everyone's lips is, who's next? After that news about your father sending innocent people to Arkham, Sounds like the whole city wants your head on a pike. The Waynes have always run this company, but now... They want to decide what your future at this company will be. Do you really think Bruce Wayne is worth protecting? <laughs> what do you want from me? You know. Yeah, Catwoman! Not for anyone. But don't worry. Bruce Wayne's finally gonna get what's coming to him. So is Bruce. this gonna be Joker? Bruce. 